Raising seven adopted children isn't easy, but CBN partner Steve and Sandra Hogue say it's worth it. We were helping change the destiny in the course of the child's life. And so that became the most important thing for us. We actually got our first four within 15 months. So we say we went from zero to four in 15 months. The young family quickly outgrew their small home. They bought a bigger house, even though they hadn't sold their first one. But the housing market was booming, so they weren't concerned. We assumed we would sell the house quickly and we would make a lot of money on it. We would drop it on our new house and have this big home and be uh, debt free from a mortgage within a few years. And it was just this wonderful master plan that did not work out at all. That's because the housing market crashed. They were unable to sell their first home and now they were stuck with two mortgages. They quickly burned through their savings. Now we're at a place where we were trying to avoid foreclosure by trying to do whatever we could to make the payments. And that meant we would sell anything we could find around the house that we weren't using or didn't need. We actually sold both of our cars literally to pay the mortgage. Things were tight for the family and they had to cut back on everything, except what they gave to their church and to CBN. We would never cut back on tithes. That is absolutely something you just have to do. At one point, they even increased their giving to CBN. Speak to them, encourage them. The Lord spoke to me actually during uh, a telephone that CBN was doing to increase our monthly giving. It's just in the natural, it was nuts. It was absolutely nuts, but we did it. Even though it was a long, tough journey, they trusted God would provide, and He did. We didn't really go without. We never went without a meal or without clothes or uh, without, without a roof over our head. God always provided. They say he even replaced their cars with two passenger vans. Two different times within four months, uh, two different people walked up to me with keys in their hand. Then finally a breakthrough. They sold the second house and walked away free and clear. It was peace that we hadn't experienced for four years. It was a, a new start. It was fresh. Now, with only one mortgage, Steve and Sandra paid off their debts. They eventually adopted three more children, and they love CBN too, especially Superbook. The Hogues have since moved into a home big enough for all of them, and they were able to keep their first home as a rental property. They believe it's all because they were faithful to give. We thank you that our kids will love you. We learned that he was our source and he alone, not our jobs, not what other people were able to give us. There's people that, um, that are wrestling with this whole, uh, do I really need to tithe? Do I really need to give? I can't afford to give. And I don't know how else to explain it, but to just test the Lord. You cannot outgive God.